Just when I thought AI video editors couldn't get any smarter, Filmora 15 arrived and it completely blew my mind. This update might just make Filmora the best AI video editor for creators in 2025. AI Extend lets you extend your clips by generating new frames, similar to Adobe's Generative Extend, but with way more control. You can create stunning new scenes that look and move just the way you imagine them. Then, there is the Filmora Pen tool, which turns motion animation into pure magic, allowing you to create custom paths for objects with seamless movement. And that's not all. I'll also show you how to make animated chart videos that turn boring data into dynamic motion visuals that actually grab attention. So, how good are these new tools really? Let's put them to the test and see what Filmora 15 can actually do. To start, here is one of the most impressive new features, AI Extend. I'm going to use it to increase the duration of this clip and the process is super simple while still giving great results. First, add the video you want to extend to the timeline. You'll find AI Extend right in Filmora toolbar. Just click it to activate the tool. Then simply drag the beginning or end of your clip to extend it. You can stretch it up to 8 seconds and the duration is easy to adjust and control. Now here is where the magic begins. For this example I wrote. Extend the video so the man keeps walking toward the mountain while recording with his camera as several drones fly around him and over the landscape. Once you've added your description, just hit generate and wait for the result. Here is how my video looks after using this tool. If you thought AI Extend was cool, just wait until you see what the new pen tool can do. It can create effects like this that really bring your footage to life. Start by dropping your video onto the timeline, then head over to the toolbar under Driving Tools and select the pen tool. From there you can start driving a line on your video. Click and drag to curve it exactly how you want. You can keep adding lines, curving each one in the direction you need until you build a full path for your effect. It's surprisingly intuitive and the creative possibilities are endless. When you're done, align it to fit your video. Next, scroll down to the shape tab and pick an effect. I went with the sparkle effect but there are plenty to choose from. You can customize the color, tweak the radius and even add zoom at the start and end to make the motion pop. Feathering and intensity adjustments lets you refine it further so it looks polished and dynamic. Animating it is just as fun. I like to add a keyframe and start with the slider at 0% at the beginning, then bring it to 100% at the point where I want the effect to appear. Add another keyframe to hold it, then bring it back to 0% where you want the animation to fade out. Once your keyframes are in place, you can move them around to get the timing perfect. It's like giving your effect its own rhythm. Finally, add your original video above the effect tracks, then go to AI matting and activate the updated smart cutout. Drop over your subject, click start and watch as the background is removed with incredible precision. Hit apply and just like that your effect is fully integrated moving seamlessly behind your subject. Another exciting new feature in Filmora 15 is animated charts. You can access it by clicking the three dots on the home page. This tool makes creating data driven chart videos completely effortless and it comes with a bunch of really interesting templates. Everything from area charts to donut charts. For this example I'm going with a column chart. Once you select your chart you can set the aspect ratio and all the customization options appear on the right. You can easily pick a color palette that fits your project, adjust the bar shapes and choose a data point label style. You can also change the header text or swap out the animation to match your style. You can even switch between light and dark modes depending on your design. Next. Head to the data tab to customize all the information. For my project, I added different popular video effects and adjusted the numbers to reflect their popularity. You can also import an Excel file and the chart will automatically use the data from it. A real-time saver for larger projects. Once you're happy with how everything looks, just go back to the preview and click Add to Timeline. From there, you can continue editing your video just like any other clip. Compared to other editors like CapCut, 
Filmora delivers a much simpler workflow while offering incredibly powerful AI tools that are perfect for content creators. One of my favorites is Smart Background Music Generation, which automatically creates background music that fits your video perfectly. The background removal tools are also noticeably more precise, giving you cleaner results with less effort. But what I appreciate most is how Filmora keeps evolving, with every update it introduces new, innovative features that make the editing process faster, easier and a lot more fun. The tools I showed you today are just the beginning. There is also dual timeline editing, an improved smart cutout, and an updated AI object remover. Plus, so much more to explore. If you want to try out all these features yourself, check out the link in the description. And if you're looking to level up your editing even further, don't miss some of my other Filmora tutorials. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.